Hi everyone, this is Shamin. I'm the founder and chief digital marketing officer at Sky DJ Agency based in Singapore. In today's video, it's a little bit special. We have been teaching about MailChimp email marketing for business owners, uh, integrated email marketing with MailChimp for e-commerce and business owners as well uh, for integrated digital and email marketing. Just to share the concepts and how they can actually leverage on MailChimp more, which is a detailed, uh, more detailed MailChimp course, I wouldn't say. Uh, it covers 100% of what MailChimp gives you in our two-day course, but uh, it's definitely a more in-depth course. But today is a little bit special because I'm going to compare two platforms that we have been using for the last two years. Although for MailChimp, we have been using it for almost six years now, and we have been teaching other people for about four and a half years now. One of the key differences about these two platforms that I personally think is most important for business owners when you are considering the platform to choose and use is the deliverability of the email. So recently in one of my posts, I actually shared about uh, the deliverability of email marketing platforms and the two platforms that i compared are of course the top two platforms that we use on our own at our agency and also where, where we teach other people on the platform deliverability is very important there are many benefits of email marketing eight different benefits and i've shared that before in other videos but i'll run through this very quickly Low marketing costs. Once you generate your email leads, you are actually it's free in a sense for you besides your time uh, to design and create and think and brainstorm about the email marketing campaigns. But these are considered direct marketing. A majority of the email marketing platforms, MailChimp and MailerLite, allows you to uh, do at least three things: forms, pop-ups, and landing pages to generate email leads. Uh, which I talk a bit, a bit more in depth in our other video, which I will share at the end of this video or uh, link them below as well, okay, in the description. The third point is that email marketing is easy to get started, measure, and share. Fourth, millennials actually prefer email marketing communications instead of uh, calls, especially, I think, right now, uh, they prefer messages and email. The problem with email is that if they have a flooded inbox, you need to be creative in your uh, from and email subject and preview text uh, so that they will be more inclined to open your emails and don't do a cold email because majority of the time, they will just mark it as spam. Attract new clients with email marketing. This is a strategy that we share in our email marketing courses, uh, especially in our two-day course, you get more time uh, to think about ways to kind of like offer something that's attractive enough so that people will subscribe to your email list or inquire with you such that they get into your email list as well. Email marketing actually helps you to build your credibility as well, strengthen relationships and improve your visibility as a brand. Recently there are many articles that are really interesting and I hope to uh, share more about uh, even for SEO, if you if people know your brand, they would rather click on your link. If they prefer the way you block the style of your information that you share, be it videos or blogs or infographics or photos, uh, they're more likely to click through to your website than your competitor's website. All right, so email marketing is really important. I talk a little bit about uh, the difference. Of course, if you have more than 1,000 email subscribers and you really want to keep your marketing budget, you could go over to MailChimp so that you can actually leverage up to 2,000 email subscribers for free. But to get started in terms of the interface, MailerLite is a really good platform to get started with. And it's really easy. I think it's much easier to use compared to MailChimp. Uh, a lot of our participants learn MailerLite faster. But the key thing that I mentioned at the start of this video is the email deliverability statistics. And you can see here that this is um, something from the email tool tester. And this uh, compares a few of the top uh, email marketing platforms, MailerLite, ActiveCampaign, ConvertKit, MailChimp, Drip, Send in Blue, and Constant Contact. So I'm just pulling that screen up for you bigger. So we do have this one day course in Singapore and also overseas. One of our training partners in Mauritius is called Pronomaris Training. And we will be 
uh, in Mauritius for the uh, email marketing course which we are sharing about Miller Lite is on the 12th of February, a Wednesday. And I just want to go through with you the dashboard about uh, in MailerLite and in MailChimp just to show you how easy it is in both platforms. You can see here that uh, the open rate is, is about uh, 23%. We have about 700 email uh, database currently. We have been cleaning very consistently every three to six months. We unsubscribe people who have never opened any of our last 10 campaigns. And we actually, we actually share with you how you can do that. Just to also add that we are also featured as a MailerLite expert on MailerLite. Okay, they reached out to us um, quite recently, I think in October or November. And we have also um, decided to be, to push uh, our efforts in sharing about Miller Lite reason because it's such an amazing platform, although it's much, much smaller brand, smaller company uh, compared to MailChimp. But as I mentioned to you, the most important thing to anything is really about usability and deliverability. If it is uh, easy to use and uh, you actually get to do things really quickly, uh, especially for us, we are a design agency. I'm a designer by training. I am more inclined to using a platform where it has amazing designs, okay? Even for landing pages, it gives you, you know, results of uh, how many views were there, what, were the, what was the percentage of the conversions. And for forms, they do the same thing as well, which is amazing. MailChimp does not have all these stats available. So you can see our latest uh, four videos to grow your social media strategy uh, popped up 240 times and have five subscribers because this pop-up is actually only attached to social media and Instagram courses, whereas SEO has more pop-ups because uh, we started this uh, giveaway much, much earlier in 2017. This is another one, uh, Facebook boost post. So 2% is roughly the conversion rates we are getting for uh, pop-ups, right? So this is lead generation. Many ways to generate leads. There's landing pages, there's forms. Uh, you can survey people. We talk more in depth about this uh, in our one day email marketing course with MailerLite for Mauritius. And currently we have both courses for MailChimp and MailerLite in Singapore. Right now I'm just going to go over to MailChimp just to show you a little bit of uh, how different it is. One of the things about MailChimp right now is that they only allow you to have uh, one audience. All right, what do I mean by that? First January or March 2017, they have actually been changing almost every three months. One of the most recent changes which is really quite difficult for people to uh, learn is that they took away something called audiences. If you are on the free plan, you only have one audience. You still have 2,000 emails as database, but it limits the number of forms and pop-ups you can create because of the database, all right? So many limitations now. It is still an amazing software. I like MailChimp, but in terms of how it's being actually presented, the information, a lot of times um, it's not very straightforward and they change up a lot and they make it such that it's really confusing for people to remember. We have many audiences and you can see the different audiences actually do trigger, do give you a summary of who how many audience you have in each database, when was it created. Our uh, older database have been deleted. We sort and clean up our database. One of the things that I personally really, really like about MailChimp was um, they actually recently started to kind of like integrate a lot of things together. But uh, one of the things about MailerLite is that it not only gives you the reports very uh, quickly, it actually has the statistic, open rates, pop-up rates, visits, which is how many people visit your landing page, which MailChimp does not have, all right? So if I show you our forms, which is here, if I go to our forms, there's no data of the forms. You can only see the form that you have created, okay? So this is one of it that we have created during our classes with our participants to kind of like walk them through creation of all these things. If you have any questions about what email marketing can do for you and your business, please reach out to us at workshops at skycrm.asia. If you're watching this and you're overseas participant or a training agency overseas, you can reach out to us for overseas training. Thank you so much for watching this video. If you have any questions, comments, uh, do drop them below. We look forward to seeing you at our next video and we definitely look forward to seeing you at our workshops.